I am starving, Mazzy. Get I'm really hungry. Chicken wings. Don't normally have these, but I do. I've always liked fried chicken. Do you? You know, like KFC chicken. Yeah. Love it. Love it to bits. Yeah. Really looking forward to this. Just something different. So you're gonna have all that hot spicy one. You've got to have hot spicy sauce, haven't you? Yeah. On everything. I ain't got much left now. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Down to half of a tub. Anyway, thank you very much, Mazzy. You're welcome. Have you seen the size of that wing on there? It's like yeah. half a chicken. <laughs> I'm not going to knock it, it's beautiful, it tastes very nice, but it's like a barbecue flavour. I wouldn't have gone for barbecue, I blame the chicken factory, not Mazzy. Um, the hot sauce on top though has changed it, it's made it nice. But, bit of a complaint, look at state of that. How can you call that a chicken wing? How can you call that a chicken wing? That's. The, I used to have them on my knees, you know when you fell off your bike? And you went to bed and your knee got stuck to your pyjamas because it all scabbed over. And in the morning your mum would have to pull it away from your pyjamas. That's what it looked like. It's just like a knee scab. That's disgusting. How can you call that a chicken wing? That is gross. What's wrong with those two? Well, I've eaten all them. I'm not eating them, Mazzy. They're some chicken worker's bike falling off his bike morning after scabs. Really? You don't, yeah, I don't, you don't know where they've been. Another little tip for people, when you're buying chicken, don't get that boneless chicken, because that's animal cruelty. There's, can you believe there's factories out there, Mazzy, who breed chickens without bones? They're just like laying there, <laughs> like, like jelly. And they, can't, they can't walk prop. they can't move. It doesn't work like that. It does, Mazzy, so always buy them with bones in them. You can always take the bones out. They don't mind now, because they're dead. But yeah. You Chickens it? with bones, they were beautiful, thank you very much. Do you feel like chicken tonight now? No, I've had some chicken, I don't want any more. So I've just been doing my calendar and figured out we've got nine days to go before we leave here. I'm going to be quite sad actually, do you think you will honey? Um, Very mixed emotions Mazzy, very mixed emotions. Yeah, it's quite a mixed, it's going to be a very mixed emotions for us because I mean we've been locked down for three months. Possibly more? Yeah, yeah. Possibly more, yeah. So, nine days today, guys. It's the 20th today. And the Travel Trolls will be back travelling. Just going to test the new Seek I Naturalist uh, app. Going to take a picture of ourselves, see what happens. So, here is me. Oh, no, let me do you. Okay, you press the button. <laughs> yeah. Ready, smile. Has it done it? Yep. <laughs> I am a human. Right. Okay, it's yeah. got me as a human. Now let's try Mazzy. It's very clever. It knows I'm a human, Mazzy. Uh-huh. So let's just try you. <laughs> let's have a look. What is Mazzy? Is she a human? We believe this is a member of Animals. No way! Some kind of insect, Mazzy. A bit green and black striped. <laughs> Let me have a look. Same thing. It comes up every time I take a picture of you. Now, somebody, <laughs> somebody actually did it. Did one of you. They took a screenshot of you and did your yeah. face. And it came up with exactly the same thing, Mazzy. Really? Why? Do I look like a... Because you're an animal. It's proof. I'm not an it's animal. It's never wrong. Mazzy is an animal, I am a human. There, fact. I'm really sad. Just been seeing what kind of animal um, my camera is. It's a giant leopard moth. <laughs> giant leopard moth, they're beautiful little animals, aren't they? So when I decided I was going to become a professional photographer and the best photographer in the world and make millions and millions of pounds from photos, I got this stuff. Now these were pretty cheap, don't know what they are. Polaroid close, oh they're macro, different macro lenses, four of them. This is the Polaroid Circular PL, that's the good high up one which I got, I don't know how much that was, I don't know, but that's what we're using. And I've got this, I don't even know what this does, Tiffin, that's a good make, quite a heavy little beast, Tiffin variable. It's quite tinted isn't it? Yeah. A variable. What's a variable? Pull it up to the camera. Let's have a look. I can't really show you. Can you see that? No, I mean pull it on the lens. Ah. Yeah. Ooh. Can you see anything? Oh, 
Yeah, it's actually see-through. I'm not really sure what it's doing. What's it? It's making you kind of look like a tunnel. A tunnel? I don't look anything like a tunnel. Just a couple more people to thank today. We have got Mark Dawson, Alan Findlater and Alie. Thank you guys very, very much. Thanks guys. Couple of new patrons. Oh. Um, four patrons. Oh. Um, we've told you in the live, I don't know if we've actually told you in a vlog, Mazzy did a Patreon video the other night on her oh, own. Oh, I did, yeah. All yeah. on her own. All on my own, guys. So if you want to go over and watch that, you'll have to become a Patreon. But or be a Patreon and get over there. Yeah. <laughs> There's a link in the description to his Patreon, so get over there if you're interested. Uh, not only that one, but you'll be able to see all the old videos we've all, always oh, yeah. put on Patreon as well. So mm -hmm. I think there's probably about 10 on there now, isn't there? I don't know. I can't get to the Patreon section, yeah. so I don't know. <laughs> so anyone who becomes a Patreon can watch 10 videos which you've not seen before. Anyway, leave it to that. Thank you very much. You can see just how hot it got the other week. Check this out. Look at this. This is like sticky yuck which is used to stick this on the on the uh, window and it's melted and gone all the way down the window how disgusting is that so it was either too well it should no it's not too warm is it it's just a really bad glue they've used a really cheap horrible design there's no way that should be melting in hot weather Right, okay, so today isn't going too well. It's really windy, the weather is terrible. So me and Dan has just decided we're gonna have a cozy day in, we're gonna get into bed, have movies all day, munchies, and I'm gonna make a really nice homely cooked meal. So let me just show you what I'm making. I'm gonna to attempt to make a Yorkshire pudding today in my oven. Now, <laughs> my oven doesn't get hot enough, so it's just trial and error, but we're gonna have bangers and mash and peas and onion gravy so i might film a bit of that but i imagine for today that's it guys i've no idea what's going on here mazzy i know it's you're making some kind of food but you know what this reminds me of what i don't know if you remember but a lot of us viewers will yeah. you remember playing frogger 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 on the atari these are like the logs and they're going along and you have to jump from one log to the other they're going that way they're going that way it looks like a game of frogger Honestly, there'll be people my age who will know exactly what I'm talking about and they'll think, yeah, you're right, Dan, it does. Tonight's tea is sausages with peas with battered um, potatoes. They've had a... Oh, they've gone through a rough time. And onions and gravy and horseradish sauce. Coleman's, only the best. From my lovely, beautiful, amazing lady. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. I got the same too. <laughs> wow. It's very, very rare I know. <laughs> that we have the same meal. So I'm looking forward to this. Thank you very much. You're welcome. I'm feeling stuffed already. I'm not used to eating these heavy meals. You're full, yeah? Yeah. You're full. Yeah. Let's, let's see how much you've eaten, Mazzy. <laughs> let's see how much you've eaten. Mazzy's full. Mm. You've literally had one. Uh, this is one of them moments where the word literally is allowed. You've had one forkful and you're I full. Yeah, I'll probably have one or two more, but yeah, I'm done. <laughs> oh, by the way, guys, my Yorkshire pudding didn't turn out right. Oh, that's another story. <laughs> Where's my Yorkshire pudding? What no, Yorkshire pudding? No, I ain't got like any Yorkshire pudding. <laughs> Are we having Yorkshire pudding? Is there isn't any Yorkshire pudding there, Mazzy? What are you on about Yorkshire pudding? You can't stop mm -hmm. talking. Tell mm -hmm. us about the Yorkshire pudding. It's like cardboard. I don't know what happened to it. I know what Yorkshire pudding is. <laughs> I know it's like cardboard, but where is it? It's not. It's it's in it. Just ah! <laughs> nice peas. Very happy with them peas. That apple crumble looks amazing, Mazzy. I can't wait to finish this so I can have my apple crumble. <laughs> Beautiful. Is there any custard to go with it? It's Yorkshire pudding. It's, I, beg, I beg your pardon, Mazzy? It's a Yorkshire pudding, but it's stark. It's, it, look, it didn't rise. It's like cake and just stodgy stuff. No, 
No, the Yorkshire... You were just on about some Yorkshire pudding, Mazzy. Where's Yorkshire pudding? Can't wait for that, Yorkshire pudding. Where is it? Try it. Try it. Tell me what you think. Try what? Well, if you want me to try that, you're going to have to get me some custard. <laughs> Do I have to pay you as well? <laughs> is that seriously Yorkshire pudding? Yeah, it didn't rise. Complete disaster. It didn't rise, Mazzy, because it's never been alive. It were always dead. It actually tastes quite nice. So we're about to go live in about one hour, 20 minutes. Yeah. Thought, thought we'd come for a quick walk down to us local. Get a bit of fresh air, because that's all that's out here today. It is. It's, well, to be honest, the sun was out when we set off and now it's behind a yeah. cloud. It's very windy today, but when it's not behind a cloud, it's actually very nice. Uh, just come down to the beach. Definitely a few seals over on our usual rock. You can see a few heads over there on the rock. The two swans are over there. Definitely some fish down here because I saw some splashes as soon as I turned up. But we're not really... There's nothing new, is there, Mazzy? But it's nice to get out the house. It is. I'll tell you what. Yeah. One thing for us, doing this... It's not always about filming because I think we've overdone that now. I don't think we can really f show you much more from here. It's a matter of just come for a walk here and then back, which can be half an hour, can be an hour. Um, and you feel better once you've got back. You know, yeah. it wakes you up a bit. We were cooped in all day yesterday, guys, because the weather was atrocious, yeah. wasn't it? And so... today the weather's been on and off. It's been gorgeous. Yeah. It's been <laughs> throwing it down. Yeah. Tomorrow it's supposed to be raining. Supposed to be, but they always keep changing their mind, don't they? They do change their mind. That's the Irish weather for you guys. Mm. But yeah, we just love coming down here. You yeah. know, the might as I say, I think we've overdone the filming. I don't think there's really much more, unless it's a great shot. Yeah. I think we've overdone it. Can't but really show you. The anymore. seals over there. I do want to have a look because they all look like they might be babies. So we'll definitely get yeah. a clip of those. You you get your yeah super camera out and get a clip yeah. over there because there's definitely three I think on that rock. Oh, there's more than that. I say five. I say three. Should we bet a cup of coffee? No. Go on. Because you're making coffee anyway. Why would I bet <laughs> that? Why would I bet that? I can't lose if I don't bet. So there's three. Looks like I owe Dan a cup of coffee. But don't tell him, yeah? Let's just keep it between ourselves. I heard that! Hey! I wouldn't say we had a storm the other day, but we had very high winds and very, very heavy rain. Just, just for a couple of hours. And you can tell that at the beach here. This wasn't here last time we came. Big pile of seaweed here. This is on like a platform, like a harbour top, if you like. None of this was here. All that's new. And in here, this was like a proper pool. All this is fresh seaweed. And if you took all that out and weighed it, you've got about a ton of seaweed there. So it must have been a pretty dramatic tide bringing all this up. There he is, honey. The hooded crow, Mazzy. Is it? It's a hooded crow, yeah, we've already seen them. Very oh. dirty looking, boring animals. No, I was going to say it looks nice. Do you think that's boring? It is. Once is it I've, inside? I've already seen one of them, Mazzy. I don't like them. They look like bullies. I just noticed this from a distance. Beautiful plant here on the, on the rocks just next to the sea. Um, and I've just put it through the plant finding app. And although we're in Ireland, it is called English stone crop. Never heard of that before. It is a sedum, which I reckon you can recognise from them. But there's like hundreds of different plants in that family. But an English, whatever I just said it was, very nice. Right next to the sea. Well, we've been spoiled today, Mazzy. Why? We've got three cormorants, or shags, all together. God, he looks scary. Why are they just standing there with their wings out like that? 
It's very peculiar. <laughs> Maybe he's drying under his arms. He's all sweaty or something. I don't know. What are you after? Me up. We're about to start our live guys in about half an hour. 20 minutes. 20 minutes, oh my God. I've got the kettle on ready for a coffee. We're gonna have dinner later on after all this. And um, yeah, I'm still a bit nervous. You're not, are you? You're just tired. I'm not nervous, yeah, I'm just very tired. But it'll go all right, Mazzy, it'll go fine. Because oh, everyone who's watching thinks we're fantastic and we think they're fantastic. So there's nothing to worry about. It's all gonna be happy. So we've got the same setup again, laptop on top, we've got our list ready, we've got lots and lots of questions. Juice. Juice. We do like to be comfy, so we're gonna do it in the bed. But we we can't wait to when we can do live streams on your phone, can we? No, you know, as soon as there's no wind, we wanted to do this outside, maybe at the beach. But we can't because it's too windy. Yeah. You can't do live streams on this because it's too windy. But we will, that will be future plans when we go Definitely. to sort of like sites and stuff. Definitely. Good morning all my lovely people. Hello. <laughs> I'm holding the camera guys so like at arm's length and it's really heavy. But anyway guys, I'm really happy today. Tell the guys what you're doing for me specially today. Well, it's the rainiest day <laughs> we've had on lockdown and Maz has decided she wants to go for a walk. Yeah, we actually left the compound. <laughs> so guys, let's stick around. We're gonna, wh where are we going again? We're gonna go to... Glen Gareth Nature Park. We've been there before for a walk. Yeah, we did vlog there before. So, um, but I do remember back in the day, early days, they did actually uh, block the entrance to get your fans in. So, yes. do you remember? So I'm hoping they're gonna remove that. It they... is open. Oh, it is, it is. Oh my God. Guys, this is going to be a brilliant day. I'll tell you I know that, Mazzy. How? Because there is a family. I can't remember the name of the family. Yeah. Who watch our videos who live in Glen Gareth. Oh, okay. So I asked them if it was open and they said yes. You've already asked them, so you knew you were going to take me there. Well, I was going to take you there the other day when the weather was nice. Oh my God. That's right. You're so cute. Yes, yeah, so stick around guys, this is going to be a good day. So we have arrived guys, we're at Glen Gareth Nature Reserve. There are all the trails and tracks that we can do. We did one before, I think we did the Big Meadow Walk. Yeah, we've got that on um, one of our videos. To be honest, I don't care which one we do today because this is the first time we've been out for about three months. So yeah, this is going to be really good. I've asked Dan what he'd like to snap today, like take a photo off. I'm not sure what, what did you say you wanted to take a photo of today? A dipper. Oh, oh, a dipper. I want to see a dipper. A big dipper. No, uh, a uh, small dipper. Don't have to be a big one. I'd like to just be able to see like a squirrel, capture a squirrel, something other than a bird. Yeah, that would be nice. That would be really nice. Fox. Bear. Fox. Bear. Bear? Yeah, that would be Do good. they have bears here? Oh, yeah. Really? Only brown, they don't have grizzlies, obviously, but they have brown bears, the little ones. Oh, wow. Yeah. I haven't even got out the fan yet, and look, he's at it already. I found something, Mazzy. I've not seen one of them before. It's beautiful. Oh, oh that's cute. beautiful. Yeah. You'll put the clip on. It looks a bit like a robin, but it's not. It does look like a robin. I think it's a chaffinch, would be my guess. So, am I right? You're always right, Mazzy. <laughs> I don't know what the question is yet, but yeah, you'll be right. Um, uh, it was a robin, we think, don't we? We think it's a robin now, yeah. Yeah, maybe a young un. It looks young, doesn't it? If someone can tell us for sure, was that a robin? But yeah, when I paused it on a certain spot, it looked just like a robin. It's just I'm used to seeing older robins and that were like a... I'd yeah, say a young un. Maybe a younger yeah. one. Never mind. Right, are we fit or...? Yeah, let's go. Let's go find some bears. So we're parked right up against them. Um, this, uh, it's another Hymer, honey. It's what an what? old one, yeah. I don't, I can't tell really what red it is because it's an Irish plate and I don't know how to work those. But that is, that would be my dream now. You know, if we did downgrade. Yeah. Something like that would be perfect. Yeah, that would be amazing. I'd love it. I would. Let's do it. 
That's gonna feel swap. <laughs> I don't think that's a robin, honey. It's a robin. No, that looks like the other one you just shoo up. Yeah, that were a robin. They're both robins. It's the same. It's the <laughs> same robin, Mazzy. <laughs> What great bird watchers we are, aren't we? And you don't know what that if what a robin looks like. So it's absolutely raining at the moment, isn't it? Absolutely raining, yeah. <laughs> I did want to say literally because I know it drives you bonkers. It is raining. That's all you have to say. It is raining. Okay. <laughs> Correct me. Um, yeah, so you'd like some lunch before we go then? We've got time, haven't well, we? Well, we just bought a cooked chicken, a warm cooked chicken. Yeah. It's throwing it down and it's getting heavier. Yeah. I think, yeah, we might as well have a chicken sandwich. We're in no rush. That's Dan's lunch. So we did actually go shopping today. We got a fresh loaf of bread and uh, rotisserie chicken. He likes the really black ones. And you're going to have some bread and pickle on it. Uh, which reminds me, in the live stream last night, people was asking me to show the label of this. There you go, guys. I don't think you can buy it in the UK. But it's handy like that. And I know you can buy the packets where you mix with milk and water or whatever. But that's really handy. That's lovely. So you want lots of pickle, honey? Lords, please, to make it nice and wet and moist. So here we are going for our first proper walk in three months. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Lockdown isn't quite over, but it is in, I think, six days now, is it, Mazzy? Uh, six days, seven days? Seven. Um, seven. Yep. <laughs> um, and you've picked the wettest, most disgusting, horrible day to do this on. It's horrible. I don't care. I really don't care about the weather today. We're out and it's beautiful and it's amazing. As long as you're happy. Yep. <laughs> I'm happy. So we chose to do the river walk, guys. You're not impressed. Look at your face. What's wrong? There's nothing alive apart from me and you. It's rubbish. Oh, don't be like that. This will be good. You've got to be quiet and just keep your eyes peeled. It would be good if it wasn't raining. It'll be good. So how do you think this is going, Mazzy? We've been walking, we've done about half of the walk already. We've just started. I knew you were getting the camera out to have a little moan. <laughs> I'm not moaning, not moaning. It's just it is only a one kilometre walk. We have mm -hmm. been walking for a good five minutes. Yeah. It won't go on for much longer. There's no birds, I don't know where they've all gone. I'll tell you where birds are, Matt. It's raining. Birds. Everything, every single thing apart from slugs, is, is in the nests and well, stuff. Uh, my mission today is to get a music montage, and if it's a music montage of slugs, then slugs so be. You're not going to get a music montage. <laughs> All music montages are in the nests and stuff as well. Nothing is out in this weather apart from me and you. <laughs> anything alive? Me. No, is there any fishies down there? No. There's nothing here, Mazzy. Everything's gone home because it's raining. Anything now? I'm not allowed to say anything anymore because everything I say is negative and I've, I'm not being positive enough. Who said that? I, I didn't even I know say what that. you're thinking. I know what you're thinking, so I'm just not going to say anything. It's a wonderful walk. I'm really enjoying myself and the wildlife here is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Best day I've had out, definitely this year. Honestly, loving every minute of it. You've got a massive gap at side. There's no reason why they couldn't have like a little, you know them chair lifts you get in old people's houses? One of them going upside, it's, it's made for it, isn't it? And they haven't got one. Are you filming me? I am. I found my first mushroom since I decided I'm going to look for mushrooms. See all this on here, look. <laughs> That's just swinging. Isn't it? it goes all the way up the tree. It's like a fungi. Um, you know what it is? What well, it could be? Uh huh. False turkey tail. 
could be. This is the trouble. You can't take that chance. Yeah, I'm not going to take the chance. But, oh. but that's saying what it could be. It could be silver leaf, fungus, it could be a few things. But it could be false turkey tail. So let's just check that out. I've never seen any of that in Asda's before. Mm, I don't think that... Oh, it could be the same. Could be. It's got like the rings. So what does it say? False turkey tail typically form in multiple brackets on dead wood. Yeah, you don't get deader than then. that. Yeah. There you go. Not 100% sure it is false turkey tail. Don't know much about false turkey tail. But I do think that is probably false turkey tail. Beautiful. <laughs> That's first mushroom, Mazzy. I've nope. got Because I've got a mushroom app now, Mazzy. Yeah, I know, but... Do you want to know what it's called? People will want to know. Because they might want to download it as what well. What the app? It's called Shroomify. <laughs> The little red mushroom there, Shroomify. It's very good, it's, it works in the same way as the other app. You take a picture and it gives you a rough idea. And then you can look into it and see if it is exactly that one or not. <laughs> hey, that was disappointing, wasn't it? Especially, yeah, because it was like a first time out in ages, but I still enjoyed it. Listen to it, look, it's terrible. Yeah, I enjoyed it. They're not wrong with the actual walk. We enjoyed that. Yeah. Is that... Whew. I think it's focused. Uh, yeah, no wildlife, simply because it's throwing it down. Can't blame yeah. them, can you? But that's the second walk there. We've done the shortest, the second uh -huh. shortest. I think there's another two or three. There's uh, the Bantry lady or something one to do. Yeah. Yeah. But never mind, you know, we've got a week left. We might even come back, Mazzy, on a oh, better day be and get good. some more, some wildlife. <laughs> Very cloudy today, guys. Are we up in the clouds or is it just foggy, honey? It's a bit of both, Mazzy. Is it? We, we just come across an amazing view. But it would have been if the weather had been nice. <laughs> yeah, it was too, too Terrible. Can't see anything now. Got my fog lights on. Home sweet home. Yes. Well, I don't think you realise how hard that was for me today. Hey, what a long journey. We're a lot of driving. A lot of driving. Yeah, we had to go shopping first, guys, didn't we? <sighs> oh. Where are we home now? We're home now. What next? I don't know. Do you want to take a walk to the beach or...? Oh... Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching! Please comment and hit the like button. That helps our channel grow. If you like what you see, click here to subscribe. Check out this other great video. And if you really want to show your support, join the club, become a Patreon for extra videos and perks. The more support we get, the more content we can give. We'll see you tomorrow on Travel, Travel Trolls, Trolls TV. TV.